Hey guys, welcome back to another week in my life vlog. This week I'm going to be doing Monday through Friday, so it's probably going to be a little bit longer. Let me know if you guys like this, or you guys like the shorter ones, or whatever. Um, I just filmed my outro for my last weekend of my life vlog. Keaton just left this morning. Today is Monday. I have so many things to do. I have to go to the studio. I'm recording. Coming back. I'm filming a video. I have to shoot a bunch of stuff. Um, and then do some work. I have Orange Theory. I have I think a connect group. I think I have plans tonight. And I also have to write a paper all in that span of time. So we'll see how that works out. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Um, yeah, I'm just going to get some work done and prep for the podcast. And I will see you guys whenever I vlog next. I don't know. I don't know why I always say that. So this is my outfit. I'm just wearing sweats. I always go really comfortable to the studio. And I don't have any meetings today. So I can wear sweats. Which is amazing. I'm about to head out. Um, I'm going a little bit. I normally go 10 to 12 on Mondays. I'm going a little bit later. Because I only have an intro in one guy. So I don't really need to be there for two hours. Okay, I'm currently on my way to the studio. I'm finishing the Ed Milet episode on his and her podcast, It's Getting Confidential. It is so good. If you guys haven't listened to it, please, please, please go listen to it. I also forgot to put my rings on, so I feel like naked, you know? So, anyways, I'm going to finish this. Um, they actually recorded literally in the studio that I am going to record, so it's just funny, but... Yeah, it's really, really good. Definitely recommend it. Everyone that knows. I share these podcasts and like episodes and books and stuff that I really recommend on the secret Facebook group for my podcast. If you guys don't know, it will be linked down below. I have a podcast. I love you so much podcast. Um, it's very conversational. It's lifestyle based and like wellness. And it's just basically people that I love and things that I learn from them. And then um, like we're talking about it and then I learn more and you guys learn and it's just cool. So check it out. It's down below who doesn't have self-confidence. This is someone who has habitually not kept the promises they made. Hey. Okay, so in the studio, I just recorded some ads and some intros. Taylor is here. You know what's so funny? Someone, after I texted you on um, my, or whatever, I need to like flip it. <laughs> After I texted you about like being on the podcast, someone requested you, oh, and I was whoa. like, "Perfect!" Oh my I was gosh. like, "Actually, yeah." I feel like I'm getting a lot of random like podcast vibes these days. Like Danielle talked about me on hers, and like three people messaged me like. Danielle was talking to an LA photographer and it sounded like you. Was it you? I'm like, that was me. <laughs> yep, was it you, literally. Gals on the go, they're gonna be in here next week. Oh, fine. Great podcast, guys. <laughs> I, I just got back from the recording. The best part about having a podcast is that it's just so like inspiring. Like, I leave and I literally talk to people that I love or that are just like amazing. I mean, I love all of them for an hour or two. And then I leave and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so ready to start my week. That's why I love recording on Monday mornings. Also, just something good to start off with. But um, a lot is coming over. We're going to film. We're going to take some photos and just get some work done that we've been needing to get done. I think she should be here like really soon. But I'm going to get some outfits ready because we're going to take some pictures because my Instagram has been improving lately, guys. I promise you. So. Guys, look at here. Okay, so this is Lana. Your hair looks amazing. She did it herself. It's not even a blowout. Yeah. You just take a flat iron, straighten your hair, and then curl it at the ends. That is amazing. Like great outfit. You look great today. Yeah, I feel like all over the place. But I okay. no, you look great. I love this. It's so cold in her house. It guys. is freezing. <laughs> it's the heater, guys. So I just finished filming a video and stuff. I was doing some stats homework. That sucks. So now that Lana's here, over with that. We're done. Um, we're gonna over take math some canceled. over math canceled. I've been using my iPad to like do my math problems on like my yeah. little notebook thing. It's really cute. Um, we're gonna take some Instagram photos. <laughs> Guys, it, I know, for real. My, it's so weird. I probably should turn this down. But I was telling a lot of this, but, uh, no, we're not really gonna use my iPhone. I was telling a lot of this, but like, I had an injury in like the second grade of my knee. Come on, chill out. And ever since, I'm 21 now, every time it rains, like my left knee hurts really bad and like it hurts right now. It's just so weird. Is this, like, that happens with old people, but I'm 21. So, we're gonna take some photos. <laughs> this is your blog. Oh. It's, not, it's not it's focusing. not focusing like, why no, is it not this, focusing this we're taking some photos but this is like ripped yeah. underneath here it's great like, and like look at what this is right here but the photo is gonna be great the whole also, setup okay guys so we just finished 
I have old school Taylor Swift playing through the house. We just like took so many photos in an hour pretty much. So my Instagram is pretty soft for a second. I have to run an errand and Lana, oh, yeah. What? It's okay, I thought that was broken. Lana is gonna go to Orange Theory for the first time. How excited are you? Very exciting. No, it'll be good. You can control your stuff. Okay. So I it's fine. A lot of shape is not no, I I hadn't worked out in eight months before going. Yeah, actually. Yeah. So like that's yeah, it's okay. Um, so I need to go pick up a package. She needs to get there early, so we're just gonna go together. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Check out my Instagram because we just took a bunch of new photos. That's finally. 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 Look at us go. I'm proud. Your hair looks even good like that. Wow. You have amazing hair now. You actually always had amazing hair. I don't know what today is, but it's very orange. Pure orange. 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 No, you just look tan. Okay. You just look tan. So, anyways, we're gonna leave. Okay, we just picked up my package. Oh my nice. gosh, it's gonna be so loud. It's raining still. It's really, really raining today. And we dropped I off some film. Oh, it's gonna get wet. We dropped <laughs> off some film to get developed, and now we're gonna go get some food and then go to Orange Theory, which is so exciting. Okay, we're at Nectar for a little. Like, I'm just so hungry. If I don't eat this right now, I'm gonna die. Um, I got the acai peanut butter. Not to be dramatic. <laughs> yeah, but I will die. So this is what we're having before our workout. Yeah. Okay, guys, we just left Yay. Orange Theory. That's uh, so good. It was really good. It wow. was, this class was like different blocks. Like the way they did the weight block is not normal. It was really? hard. It was a strength day. If you guys know anything about Orange Theory, I'm then, no strength. You know, yeah, I'm like <laughs> dead. I'm like literally dead. So. Why are they so mad? They don't know how to drive in LA. Yeah, they just don't. Well, why are all these you know cars going to work out? Yeah, if you guys went to Orange Day like us, you guys would get it. Anyways, on my home, I have something in an hour, so I need to shower and get ready for that and be there in an hour. I look insane because so. I'm um, sharp. I mean, I went to the gym. But I no, me too. Forward. I feel gross. I forgot to take it off. It's, I did that the other time. It like, like sticks to you. Oh, it feels disgusting. I can't wait to get it off. Uh. Ew. Okay. <laughs> Okay guys, I just got a package from Dr. Dennis Gross. I'm going to read this off camera really quick. Okay, so, can you open it? I'm so excited. I've been seeing this, oh my gosh, do you hear my phone? Everywhere, okay. The clinical grade IPL dark spot correcting serum. Save a spot on your top shelf for. Okay, so does the Dr. Dennis Gross clinical grade IPL dark spot correcting serum. Okay. They were like raving about this and this is exactly what I need. It's supposed to help with discoloration and smoothing out your complexion, which, you know, I really need that. So, I'm so excited. I'll do like a first impressions with this. Okay, so I'm going to try this out for the first time. I'm really excited. I've been wanting to try like Dr. Dennis Girl stuff out for a while. Okay, it's a dropper. Oh my gosh. Oh my it feels really good on my skin like really really good wow wow i love serums you guys know that i'm like a skincare fanatic so anything that's new i'm all about okay i will update you guys like later on tonight or tomorrow on how this goes but it like it just feels really good on your skin and it's light it's not like one of those oily um like gross you know what i mean like when they're like gross serums it doesn't feel like there's gonna be things like sticking to my face. It just feels good and like it's actually in my skin. So, big fan. I love this. Okay, I'm showered. I'm out. I have Connect Group um, literally just down the street right now. So, I'm not gonna vlog there. I'll vlog when I get back. I actually just got so much of my paper done. I thought I'd be up late tonight, like writing it. I already have my outline done, so it wasn't gonna take that long. But I think it's only gonna take me like 30 more minutes when I get home, which is amazing because I need to sleep. So, I'll see you guys when I get back. Okay guys, I got home from Connect. I finished my paper way quicker than I thought and I'm gonna go to bed. I will see you guys in the morning for class and pretty busy day actually. Today was good, got a lot done. Did a lot, you know? Everyone, it is 7 a.m. I just got ready. I'm about to head out for the day. I'm gonna meet with Sav at Starbucks um, before because as interns, we are over like marketing and stuff for the semester. So we're gonna work on some more marketing stuff and then I have class. Um, today is Jersey day. Uh, this is all I have. I'm wearing this. I just have a Dodgers t-shirt. I'm wearing leggings again to class, guys. I haven't worn leggings in public besides working out probably in a year, and here I am again. But 
just wearing this leather jacket, um, some tennis shoes, and I don't want to wear this shirt all day, so I'm actually just going to bring this Harvard crew neck to change into after our, like, staff um, student meeting, which is this morning, but that's why we're wearing with the jerseys and stuff, so... Wore me out. I wore them out. I wasn't any good, but, but, but that's what I was trained in. Okay, guys. So I am on my way to class right now. It is like 7:20. Um, I am so cold. I don't even know why I'm so cold. But I'm gonna pick up Sam, and then we're gonna go to Starbucks. Um, class doesn't start until 9:30 today. So we have our staff meeting, or it's like staff student meeting. I always say staff meeting because that's what we call it, but like it's the student one too. Um. Because obviously we're not on staff. And then, oh, what is going on here? And then we have time to do schoolwork for a little bit, which I normally have to get food, intern meeting, and then we have workshop. I don't know what we're doing for workshop today. But yeah, today, tonight, I really just want to get a lot of schoolwork done and a lot of editing done. My school week ends tonight, but I turned in everything, so I want to like get ahead. What I always, always, always do is I'm always working on the next week's schoolwork on Tuesday. So like it's never like what's due that night, it's always the next week. So then I like constantly am staying ahead and I don't get as like stressed out and stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna get ahead, do all that stuff. We'll see what I end up, I don't know, maybe some friends will want to do homework or something. So, if you guys have heard me talk about the Ed Milet episode on the Skinny Confidential, he also has a podcast, so I'm listening to his podcast. I went on it last night to see, because I was like, oh, I'll listen to one on the way to class, and they have John Maxwell on, or he has John Maxwell on, and John Maxwell is like, like, business leadership business leadership genius he was a pastor for like 25 years he's been huge my school loves him like my director loves him we talk about him all the time read his books blah 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 but i'm listening to the podcast right now and it's really good So I'm with Sav at Starbucks. It's been a whole two days, one day apart. It's just yeah, a lot. It was awful. When we go one day apart, it's just too much for like, us. We just like can't do it. We can't do it. Easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're working on some marketing stuff for ZLC. I have my oatmeal that I haven't even opened because all I can eat is oatmeal right now, guys. Um, we are getting stuff done. Also, look at my Good Notes app. Okay, first off, my handwriting is ugly and atrocious, especially on this thing. I'm like, what? But it, it's, yeah, look at that. Really cute. <laughs> so I like actually, she's the, like if you go on Zoe's Instagram, the flat, like the, the notes that are really pretty, it's literally Sav. And then and it, this is me, so. <laughs> hey guys, we're on our way to class. We got a lot of stuff done. This good notes thing is really fun for me. Made some envelopes. Still with Sav. Um, that's it, bye. <laughs> One time Dom and I did announcements for the, the Devo, or the meeting, remember when we did vocal warm-ups? Oh, <laughs> we, we haven't been asked to do it again, but, that? like last semester. What? Was you were like here. Area? Yeah, you had to have been. Yeah. It was like a really big thing. Wow. Yeah, we were like, I oh, I think I called oh, it. Really good. Yeah, we, they were on my Instagram too. It was like a big deal for us. Yeah. Come. Did I do It's raining, it is so loud. I'm on my way home. KJ is following me because we're doing homework. KJ is following me because we are doing homework together. And yeah, it was a really great day class, good workshop, good day. See you guys at home. It is 7.30, I just got ready for class. I don't have class until 10.30, but I'm getting coffee with someone before. I need to leave, like, basically now, so I'll talk to you guys in the car. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, this is my official intro for today. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't vlog much last night. Literally, all I did last night, I was, I picked up some disposables. Ooh, I made a new disposable Instagram. I'll put... What am I doing? I'll put it on the screen. It's Kim Possible, Call Me, Beat Me. Um, basically, it's just more of like a personal Instagram and it's just my disposables and it's like my friends and my life and it's really cute. Um, and then literally KJ was over and we did schoolwork from like four to like 10. And then I did more after that and then I fell asleep. So it wasn't anything too crazy. And I'm kind of afraid that this vlog is gonna be too long. So yeah, today is Wednesday. I have, I'm getting coffee with someone. And then we have our second year teaching. 
what the heck yeah so we have your teaching we have lunch and then we have tracks and then we have like a prayer night tonight and i'm hanging out with friends so i probably won't vlog too much today but that's fine because the next two days we'll be vlogging a lot and i feel like like i said there's too much footage right now so it's still really cold in my house really cold here it keeps raining it finally stopped i love the rain but lately i've kind of been over it which is a first for me i like the rain when i don't have to like drive over laurel canyon that's when i like the rain all right um i just left coffee i'm going to go into class now it's like cozy i got the cutest text from one of my like best friends from home i literally almost started crying anyways i'm God, I'm so tired. Okay, I'm on my way to class. Okay, okay. guys, ooh, not cute. Wait, hold on. This is angle? This is, what? Oh. Hold on. Oh, uh, this is like my hair. Guys, this is so bad. Hmm. So, we're, first, we're like 20 we minutes late to here? class. No, we've literally been here for, like, almost an hour. Because the people keep getting it wrong. We just, we have to, like, cut, we have, like, these restroom signs for prayer night tonight, right? No, but, Kenzie. It's still not perfect? It's still not perfect. <laughs> They printed the wrong things. Oh, wait, hold on. We you know what? This. Who cares, though? Because I feel like... It'll be in there. Yeah, you won't see it. I'm going to be like, Erica, we'll cut it ourselves. Like, At this, this point... This is actually yeah. horrible. Have you ever been to a FedEx where they make you do everything yourself? When you have no idea how to use this equipment, it's like the ugliest thing that's ever happened to me. <laughs> like, it's literally just ugly. Like, there's nothing. Still not perfect. No, no, no. We'll, we'll just cut we'll it. We'll cut it elsewhere. There we go. Better <laughs> angle. <laughs> yeah, perfect. Is that good? But at this point, anything's better than yeah. what we're spending in the Oh my gosh. And it's raining, and we have to carry these back to the office. Wait, and we have to, have to go pay, the and then... Oh yeah, true. Call. Yeah, and we have to walk in the class late. Oh wait, no, I'm done. We got it, okay. Oh, oh, shoot. Sorry. <laughs> okay, all this for Why the Why are these signs so big, though? Like, different. these are very aggressive restaurant no, signs. this looks like a pirate. <laughs> Like, <laughs> yeah, I just need your sweater, the one that oh. the one that Torrin said you're like a pirate in. Okay. It's okay. Who was he last yesterday? Did the jacket he was wearing yesterday? Um, who was he? Oh, uh, one of the village people. <laughs> Wait, guys. Oh no. God, did you ever forget that smoothie? It no, looks I so know. Good. It's so good. Mm, spin it. <laughs> How many cups? Probably like ten. I don't know. Our veggie girl is here. I'm working on the ZLC vlog that's coming out. It'll probably it'll be up. No, well, I don't know. Check out the channel down below. Check on the channel. Check on the channel. We're having a vlog talk meeting. Our food is here. God bless you. Today I have like this little headache and I can't. Can I just have a venti cold brew with coconut milk and then oatmeal, please? Okay, guys. It is pouring rain. <laughs> It is Thursday morning now. I'm so sorry if the rain is so annoying, but like there's not really much I can do. We're like living with it. It's been raining all week. I love the rain, but I'm just like over it because driving to class is so much more annoying with the rain. It's so loud. Oh my gosh. As you guys can probably tell, I'm exhausted. Thursday mornings, I'm always like so tired. It's the past two weeks, we've had prayer night and then we like gone to Gracias Madre after and I didn't get home until like one. Then I had to wake up early and like yesterday was a full day and at the whole, I'm just so tired. But I'm in the Starbucks drive through so that's fine. Um, we have like chapel and then we have like a teaching thing. Anyways, Sav and I, Sav, George and I went and got our nails done last night. Well, George didn't get his nails done, but he helped us pick out ours. I don't know why it's not showing. I just gotta fill, they're a little bit darker and like less like light purple. Um, as they were before and then we had prayer night and then we had Gracias Madre with some friends It was really Thank you You watch? Here, for this and this one, I am Hey guys! What's up? Do you want to show them your smoothie of the day? Guys, so we've been doing the Daniel Fast and they know all about the Daniel Fast This is my snatch smoothie Snatched! Um, to let you know what is in this smoothie, it's pineapples a ton of pineapples. Shit. Yeah. She like tried to fight everyone okay. last night because bro. No, 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 no. This. We're on you opposing sides. We're you need to listen right now. <laughs> okay. Everyone needs to listen up. We were at Gracious Madre, this restaurant, whatever. Okay, they had nachos. They put pineapple. Pineapple on top of these nachos. I, okay, to be fair, like I've never seen pineapple on nachos. That is okay. But pizza? I like pineapples on anything. Like pizza, I'm one of those I have like a I'm not for like pineapple on pizza. Like honestly, that's a move of Satan, not a move of God. <laughs> but at the same time, like 
I can understand that more because the flavors complement each other like barbecue pizza, chicken, pineapple. Yes. It's like sweet. Like, no, no, no. Nachos? Bro, what? <laughs> like, it was weird. Like, I'll give you that, but like, Dom literally, like, Dom has, like, the most severe case of food envy I've I ever have. seen. Like, she will never be pleased with what she ordered. <laughs> ever. Like, um, literally ever. Oh, hey, guys. Am I, like... Guys, am I gonna hit this car? Like... You have a lot of space. Okay, I just feel like I might... Just keep no, who cares? Whatever, it drives. Alright, see you guys in a sec. So, basically, Dom was, like, really upset about these pineapples whatever and now she's eating them fake fake no, fake in fake. a smoothie let me finish my smoothie haul so my haul. unreal we, okay, okay. Yeah. pineapple blueberries spinach a banana more spinach it's it's a, not i understand I, yes also guys we want to say thank you for everyone who loved our podcast yes, episode guys it'll be linked down below a new one came out today with hannah forcier check it out um yeah we're gonna go into class now yes i love you guys thank you so much yes. you guys are the best i'm happy happy that that you guys enjoyed liked it. yeah it's great guys if you wanted to know if you guys were wondering if it's raining again the answer is of course it is i think today ooh, the so last day is supposed to be raining. Oh, there's there's literally water on my. Bro, it's... I have Xavier's water bottle in my car, and I was gonna. I literally left it in there again. It's okay. That's great. I've, you know, when you like need to get something out of your car, and you like, it's been like four days, and you keep telling them that you will, and you just forget. Yeah. It's me right now. What was that, Dom? Guys, this is literally sewer water going into my smoothie right now. Yeah, but I'm no. like, mm, yep, we love it. Drink up. Drink up. Hey guys, it is now 4 p.m. I'm back from class. It was an amazing day. I didn't feel much in school, but it was just such a good day. Like seriously, the best morning. And like, I just love my school and I love my friends. We'll talk about that in a sec. Um, I just changed into some workout clothes. I'm about to go head off to Orange Theory. Tonight is girls night. We're having girls night. The girls and Caleb, it's gonna be so fun. So, yeah. Guys, I have my Orange Theory like heart monitor. If you guys go to Orange Theory, do you forget this all the time? Like, I'll just take it off. I need to just leave it in my car. That's my phone. Okay, thank you. But like, I literally, oh my gosh. I literally forget it all the time. My past two classes, I forgot it. This time, I have it. I'm proud of myself. Hey guys, um, I just wanted to do a little heart to heart as I'm on my way to Orange Theory. Because I've just, like this week especially, I like literally could cry right now. I've cried about this a billion times. This week especially, um, I think I've had like an overwhelming like sense of like gratitude and thankfulness in my life. I tweeted last night, this is not what it's about, but I was like so crazy how like the things that, oh, hello, the things that I thought I really wanted are now the things that I'm like, th like genuinely like so authentically praising and thanking God for taking out of my life. I'm gonna like pull over so we can just chat because I need to like chill for a second. I think in a time that's like been really dark and really hard and like I just don't even have the words most of the time I think that's like I just literally don't have the words but I've seen like life from death in a new way like I've never seen something like this I think I don't know just like a way that's like more like applicable to people's lives is I wish that I had the notes dang I really wish that I had the notes from today but I don't have my backpack but it was essentially like like even with a like unity and whatever and then like even with like broken relationships like God brings together new ones and just stuff like that and like I am so grateful for the people who are in my life and like the girlfriends especially like I am in I guess in, what I'm trying to say is like in one of the like hardest times in one of the most like ups, like heartbreaking heart-wrenching like times in my life my family's life like whatever it is I still feel like so like at peace and like light and I think I've like been able to see so much good I just like don't want to cry but I'm just so grateful for like the people in my life and like I've been like literally praying like specifically like for like a girl group of friends here because like I have that at home I have that like on YouTube and stuff but 
and I have a lot of like girlfriends in LA but not like a group of friends and not ones that like I'm with all the time like I'm always at Zoe so it's easier if it, there, it's like a Zoe thing basically um, and like in one of the the darkest hardest day of my life like that basically came together and I like know that I'm where I need to be and I know that I'm who I need to be with and it's so crazy like even like new people who have come into my life like Dom and I have been talking about that I'm like we just feel so light like it's just weird like not even in the sense of like I look at my last six months versus now and the past month has been like the last six months were not that difficult like there was not a lot of like horrible bad things going on the past month has been like the hardest month ever and for some reason I still feel lighter it's just weird I don't know I just feel really light and I think it's like crazy how all that works this is like a ramble I don't know I'm just like so so grateful for the people that I have in my life and like Sav and Dom and KJ like literally guys I don't know what I would have done this past month six weeks whatever it is like it's crazy so yeah I'm just really grateful for them tell the people in your life that you love them and yeah I this is like a ramble I don't even think much of it made sense but I think like also to the fire purifies the depths of your relationship and like don't fight against the fire because sometimes like God is using the fire to like um take out what doesn't need to be in your life and like whatever so i'm on my way to orange theory i don't think any of that made sense but i'm just really grateful and i think another thing that i've learned is that like i was reading this book and it's like um morning and like celebration like they're not like respecters of each other like you have to learn that like there's a time for everything but like it doesn't mean that you only do one like a lot of the time like there's joy and there's like death at the same time like there's things like that and learning that like you can do both and like how to do both and like not missing out on certain things you know, like I don't know it's just like crazy it's just a weird thing but um yeah that's all I have to say I don't think any of this made sense I'm like a little bit delusional I don't really know how I'm making a orange theory but yeah I just feel light like I feel very very light and I think without really realizing it I was feeling very heavy the past few months and I don't really know why. All I know is that like something has changed and something is different and I don't feel that. So, yeah. Guys, I remembered my, oh, it is, oh, thank God. Okay, I remember my heart monitor, but I thought it was dead, but it's not. Okay, so I'm going to class now. Goodbye. <laughs> Just got out of Orange Theory. I'm at Nectar and I just got a um, Aussie peanut butter bowl. This is my favorite bowl. It is so good. Oh my gosh. Okay, done working out. I just ate a little bowl. Now I'm gonna go home and shower, get ready for girls' night. Can't wait. Whew. Okay, I just finished my workout. Oh my gosh, it is cold. I ate that whole bowl and now I'm like so cold. So anyways, it's like six. It's girls night tonight plus Caleb. We've had this plan for like a week. It's really exciting. You guys, we love girls night. <coughs> so I'm gonna go home and shower. They actually are all working. So it's not gonna start till like 9.30 or 10. Um, we don't have like class tomorrow or anything. So I'm gonna go home, shower, maybe clean up a little bit. No, definitely clean up a little bit and then um, do some computer work. Um, so yeah. Okay, so update on my Dr. Dennis Gross treatment that I tried out a few days ago. I have been loving it. It leaves my skin with like the best texture and it really just evens it out, which I really, really needed. So if you guys want to check this out, I'm going to have it linked down below, but it's just so awesome. Okay, so I'm applying this right now. Um, it is currently 7. They're not coming over until like 9, 10-ish, so I can get some work done, which is actually really nice. While well, they're all at work. Oh my gosh, this serum is like the best serum ever. I might honestly walk to the market and get just a cup of coffee because I'm out of K-cups right now. And just like get so much stuff done. Like while I'm here, I might as well. So, it'll be good. Okay guys, I'm literally about to walk to the market. Literally with my Uggs. I do not know how these made it to LA. I couldn't tell you. I accidentally left my Ugg slippers in Texas. My dad hasn't mailed them back yet which is horrible because I wear them every day, but like I literally have, like they're not even on right. This is embarrassing. That's hard. I like the I, like I, like I love being home. Uh, 
Okay guys, it is now the next morning. It's like 8 a.m. I stayed up until like 2.30 or something, which is really late for me and unheard of, but it was just so fun, like so fun. I'm sorry I didn't vlog. I honestly just like didn't really think about it. And this vlog is really long, so I'm gonna end it and do another vlog for this weekend or today and tomorrow or whatever, because Danielle and Brooke are in town. They're actually on a flight right now to get here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like the long vlogs, let me know. If you hate them, let me know. Subscribe if you guys have not already. Check out my Instagram, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.